The entrance of God's word gives light and it brings understanding to the simple. Even as you're about listening to this message by the man of God, we hope that the light of God's word will be shed abroad in your heart. You will know what to do and you will know how to live. And so if you're new to this channel, kindly hit on that subscribe button for us. And then like this message. Also go to the comment section and comment whatever you have learned. Share this message abroad because we won't always be a blessing to the world. Thank you. Now when you say in heaven, what is in your mind? One planet somewhere or where you are now. Or don't you believe you're in heaven? Huh? You believe? Please be answering because people are listening to you all over the world. Don't you believe you're in heaven? So they will not think I gathered unbelievers by Uyo and just... Don't you... <laughs> don't you believe you're in heaven? Okay, you want to go to heaven? If you live where you are now, the only place you can go is hell. <laughs> if you live where you are now, the only next place that is available. <laughs> Glory to our God. Tell your neighbor I'm going nowhere. I have already arrived. <laughs> Heavenly race. I don't go tired. Why you go tired? Now Jackie walk. <laughs> Heavenly race. I don't go tired. Heavenly race. You are racing, but you will never arrive. You kebo shakaya. You didn't want heaven without us. Jesus, you brought heaven. Yeah, no, no. Wait first, wait first, wait first. Sometimes we sing, but we don't believe what you are singing. You say Jesus brought heaven down, and then you want to make heaven. How? Are you having a psychiatric condition? Jesus brought heaven down. Heaven came down. He was glory. Wait, wait, don't get me too happy. Let me finish. Let me finish. <laughs> you are seated in heaven right now. Which heaven are you seated in? I am all Shakayada. You are seated in Christ's heaven right now. Did you hear what I said? You are seated where? In Christ's heaven when? Right now. You know, Paul was so emphatic. He said, who has blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenlies, which heavenlies? In Christ. And he tells you what the blessings are. He tells you who you are. And you know, Paul was very clear when he says all spiritual blessings in heavenlies. Then he told you where the heavenlies are in Christ. So heaven is where? Heaven is where? Oh, 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 oh. oh, 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 oh. Heaven is in my heart. All right, oh, all right, oh. Hebrews chapter 9, verse 28. Hebrews chapter 9, verse 28. Read for me, girl. Hebrews 9, 28. So Christ was once offered to bear the sins of many, and unto them that look for him shall he appear the second time without sin unto salvation. Shall he appear? It's not a physical appearance. It's the word optanomai. Optanomai. O-P-T-A-N-O-M-A-I. It means to see. So he will appear in us the second time. Okay? At salvation, he is seen with us. That's why he said, for this cause, he's not ashamed to call us brethren. So which means we are identified with him. When he died, he died for sins. When he appeared the second time, he appeared with us in glory. How? By giving us his spirit. 
Look at Hebrews 12, 22. Hebrews chapter 12, verse 22. But ye are come unto Mount Zion, and unto the city of the living God, the heavenly Jerusalem, and to an innumerable company of angels. You are come already to the heavenly Jerusalem. You are not going to go to the heavenly Jerusalem. You don't go. You are come. So right now, where are you? You are in the heavenly Jerusalem. Right now where you are, you are in the heavenly Jerusalem. Is it clear? We are come. We will not come. We are come. You know the book of Hebrews is very clear. It says to us that we are come to Mount Zion, to the city of the living God, to the heavenly Jerusalem. So if he has been talking about heaven scenes in the book of Hebrews, he now says heavenly Jerusalem where you are come. So you have come. So if you have come to the heavenly Jerusalem, where are you going again? Huh? If you have come to the heavenly Jerusalem, where are you going again? So question. Is there a distance between us and God? No. Huh? No. I am in him. He is no distance. No distance. No distance. Is there a geographical location where God is? No. Huh? no. When Jesus was on earth, where was the father? In Christ. So is there a geographical location where God is, where we will go and meet him? Huh? No. You know, many people don't know how to interpret visions. Jesus was seen on the throne in a vision. I'll deal with that in the next service. See what Paul called godliness. It has the promise of the life that now is. And that which is to come. That is, we are not going to change our approach to God. It's constant. Where we are now is where we will always be. Hmm. So we have the best of two worlds. Heaven and earth. Question, where is heaven and earth? Huh? No, wait. Where is heaven and earth? In the spirit. In the spirit. You are in heaven now in the spirit. And you are on earth now in the spirit. Huh? You are in the spirit. Are you not in the spirit? Romans chapter 8 verse 9. You are in the spirit. So you are in heaven in the spirit. And you are on earth in the spirit. Please pay attention because this is a lot of renewing of the mind. So you can agree with scriptural realities and not religious realities. Now why will Jesus say whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven? Because he gave you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. So if you have the keys of the kingdom of heaven and you have the resources of the kingdom of heaven, where are you? In heaven. Jesus said, believe in God, believe also in me. If I'm telling you something, take it. <laughs> now, are we on the earth? Power city. Yes. Are we on the earth? Yes. Are we in heaven? Yes. So can we function in both worlds? Yes. How do we function in heaven and on earth? In the spirit. Who can function in both worlds? Huh? the believer so we are risen with Christ and seated together with Christ where shouting let the devil hear you and yet we walk in the flesh on earth huh? the best of two worlds so we have the best of two worlds which is the spirit of God and the spirit of God is the father did I teach that? Okay. So we are in heaven 
and we are where? We are so grateful for having you here on our platform. Kindly hit the subscribe button if you are new here. And also like this message for us. Do well to comment in the comment section because we want to know what you learned and where you're watching us from. Thank you, message community.